Hey folks, welcome to Rally TV. I'm Rick Reina. I'm with my beautiful wife, <laughs> Nettie Ray. Welcome. It's an honor to have you with us. We are on part three of Do Season for 2024. Mm, Amen, Rick. I'm excited about this. <laughs> Yes. God has given us a word. Those mm -hmm. of you that have been watching, mm -hmm. I pray that you've been encouraged, you've been blessed. Yes. Every year, God gives us a word mm -hmm. as we're exiting mm -hmm. a year. Yeah. God gives us a word for the new year. Mm -hmm. He speaks to us things so we can have faith. Amen. You know, it's yes. impossible to mm -hmm. walk with God without faith mm -hmm. or to please God. Exactly. But when God gives us words, he's actually given us faith mm, so we can walk with him. Yes. And I'm excited for what God is saying about 2024. Me too. He said 2024 will be due season for you. Mm. Now, I know he's talking about every good seed that we have sown. Mm -hmm. The time has come. It is due. Yes. Uh, you yes. know when a bill is due, uh -huh. Uh -huh. it is due now. It's due. Yeah. It is due now. Yes. Lord, I thank I you. It. it is due mm -hmm. season. It is due now. Yes. God said every good seed that we have sown, it mm -hmm. is due season. Amen. <laughs> so this is the word that God has given us. Mm -hmm. And I want to read you a few thoughts before we get into what we're talking about today. I want to say this. Life is a seed. Mm hmm to do life, to have life, yes. it's a seed. It's an opportunity for you to sow seeds. Yes. It, it could be good seeds mm -hmm. or bad seeds. Exactly. And everybody's going to reap the seeds they sow. I know. Mm -hmm. So um, I want to say this. Your life is a seed. Mm -hmm. Now, knowing that, mm -hmm. Nettie, I want you to talk about this. You always say... Everything you do in life is a seed. <laughs> yes. Let me read that thought again, and I want you to talk about okay. that. Your life is a seed. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, go ahead, talk about well, it. Well, I like to consider everything I do, say, I think before I do something, because I know it's a seed. Whether you're at the store, mm -hmm. and you're, you know, you're with, you're at the store, and you're trying to, um, you're, you're at the cashier, and you're buying something. And maybe they're rude to you or, you know, they're not very nice. Okay, but my response is a seed. Her, re but also her, the way she's acting is a seed too. It doesn't matter if she's tired or what's going on, but still a seed. Mm -hmm. And it's, you know, it's good or bad. But my response, so every time I do something, I think, okay, wait a minute. What kind of seed am I sowing here? Wow. Because I'm going to reap it. Mm -hmm. Even when you're parking, you're trying to find a parking. Someone cuts in front of you. Okay. You get mad or are you, that's, no, I'm going to be nice. That's my seed. But it was also that person's seed. Mm -hmm. If they cut in front of you and they stole your parking, that's their seed too. Mm -hmm. So everything you do in life is a seed. Yeah, everything we do. So by knowing that, <clears throat> mm -hmm. we should be paying attention yes. every single day what type of seeds we're sowing. Mm -hmm. Let me read you some thoughts here. The Lord said 2024 is going to be a due season mm -hmm. year. Yes. So we're going to begin to reap like never before uh, all the good seeds we I have sown. I believe that. And God said so. Mm -hmm. God is saying every good seed that we have sown, it's important to him. Mm -hmm. Think about that. Yes. The king of the kingdom is saying, hey, Rick, mm -hmm. Nettie, rally TV viewers, mm -hmm. what you have sown, it's important to me. Mm -hmm. Yes. God is. has not forgotten mm -hmm. about every good seed we have sown. Yes. Now, we shouldn't forget either. So Amen. I want to encourage you to start writing down mm -hmm. all the seeds that you sow. Mm -hmm. Now, today we're picking up. I have a list of things that we have sown. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I wrote them down. Because God is saying, this is what my 2024 is going to look like. Mm. It's going to look like the harvest of the good seeds I've sown. Amen. I agree. I, I want to say this. I had the Lord say to me as well. He says, Rick, I want you to uh, keep your hand on my mercy. Mm -hmm. Mercy simply means God treating us 
like we never sinned. Yes. Or, 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 or mercy shouting, you're not guilty. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm innocent. Yes. Mer God's mercy says I'm innocent. Yes. So I'm innocent because not on purpose I'm trying to sow bad seeds. No. Mm -hmm. But thank God I don't have to reap all the bad yes. seeds. I'm, so now, now, exactly. now, I mean, I hear some of you say, well, you mean I can do bad and not sow bad harvest? No, 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 you can't do that. Mm -hmm. You can't do that. You know. You need to make up your mind and your heart. You're not going to be sowing bad seeds. Yes, Just like exactly. you said, your response to the cashier lady mm -hmm. or the person that stole your parking spot. Mm -hmm. You have to make up the, your mind and your heart and your decision that you're mm -hmm. going to sow good seed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I wrote a list of things that I have been sowing. Yes. Now, this is my list. Mm -hmm. Nettie, I want you to read the foundation scripture because this backs up what I'm about to say. Yes. Galatians 6, 7 reads... Be not deceived, God is not mocked, for whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. So God is saying, hey, whatever you sow, you're mm -hmm. going to reap. Yes. So exactly. whatever list you have, mm -hmm. you're going to reap that mm -hmm. list. And you're whether you think about it or not, mm -hmm. everybody in this world is reaping mm -hmm. what they sowed. Mm -hmm. Us as believers... We're reaping what we sow as well. Everyone is. Well, but I want to say this too. Listen, this message came, Nettie, because there was a, maybe two months ago where I was kind of looking at my list. <laughs> I was kind of tallying up uh -huh. of everything we have sown. And this is, well, you know, God, I'm grateful for <laughs> what, you, you know, what you have allowed us to reap. Uh -huh. But God, I, I really don't see the hundredfold. Yeah. And that's when he told me, Rick, you're stepping into a season, 2024, it's called due season. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. He yeah. encouraged me. So I yeah. want to encourage you today. Listen yes. to me. Mm -hmm. Don't be discouraged. Mm -hmm. Don't get discouraged. You're going to reap your harvest here. Mm -hmm. All right, let me read you a list of some of the stuff we have sown, and there's much more. But don't get mad at me because I've sown these things, mm -hmm. and I... I can expect a harvest on these things, all right? Yeah. Some of these things are spiritual, some are not. But still, Nettie, read the scripture mm -hmm. again. Galatians 6, 7. Be not deceived, God is not mocked. For whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. Whatsoever. Mm -hmm. Whatsoever. If you sow a smile, a kind word, mm -hmm. you're going to reap that. Yes. All right, let me just kind of go through these very quickly. Mm. Uh, finances, mm -hmm. sunglasses, mm -hmm. watches. We sold over oh, close to 100 watches. Motorcycles, mm -hmm. backpacks, handbags, cars, offerings, tithe, our home, mm -hmm. our time, meals, yeah. ministry, words of the gospel. We left off there on show okay. two. Yeah. I went for a quick walk in between TV shows right now, and this is what I heard. Whenever you sow the words of the gospel, or let me, let me, let me, let me bring it like this. Whenever you sow the word, meaning you speak the word mm -hmm. for healing, yes. for soundness of mind, okay. however you use God's word and you sow it, and you yeah. sow it, you yeah. declare it, you stand on it, mm -hmm. you're going to reap it. Yes. If you're sowing healing scriptures, guess what you're going to reap? Yes, healing. If you're sowing financial scriptures, guess what you're going to reap? Finances. All right? Mm -hmm. So never count you quoting the word as lost time. Mm -hmm. You need to look at, look at it like this. I'm sowing seed. Yes. In your morning time, or whenever you spend time in the word and prayer, it's not wasted time. No. What is it? No. Seeds. Mm -hmm. Seeds. Yes. Whenever yes. you ministers lay hands and pray for people, maybe you have a healing line, you're going to reap healing. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying. Yes. When you take time to sow mm -hmm. the words of the gospel, you're going to reach the gospel. Mm -hmm. You, you don't think I know anything about the gospel? <laughs> I do. Yes. <laughs> because I sow the gospel. Yes, All that's right. right. All right. How about words of kindness? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So the other day we were having a meeting in Los Angeles 
and oh, yeah. uh, there's two buildings next mm -hmm. to each other and there's maybe you know 50 parking spots mm -hmm. and uh, the same lady owns both buildings mm -hmm. she said we have all the spark parking spot but the lady that was renting the building next to us she only gets four yes well i noticed all the parking spots were filled before our meeting even started uh -huh. i'm saying these are not even our people so yes. I, I i kindly went over there and said ma'am mm -hmm. i believe you're supposed to have four we're supposed to have the rest of the parking. Yes. She got very upset. Uh -huh. She started talking to another person. She ignored me, but this is what I did. I felt getting upset trying to come on me, <laughs> but I said, no, I'm going to be nice. I said, ma'am, I really appreciate your time. Thank you so much. Thank you for your time. And she didn't even look at me no more. <laughs> Long story short, mm -hmm. I walked back mm -hmm. to our building that we were renting. Mm -hmm. Two minutes later, she came in, whole different person. Mm -hmm. She apologized. She 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 was a different person. Yes. Why? I sold good words. Yes. Listen, we'll be right back. <laughs> Thank you for watching Rally TV today. We believe you're enjoying the message. For more information about Rally Ministry, visit rallymin.org. Stay connected with us through our social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, and X. There you'll be informed on what's happening from events to encouraging messages and new episodes of Rally TV. Like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Just search Rally Ministry. There you will find past and current episodes of Rally TV plus live stream events. We have a podcast available on all podcast platforms. Just search for Rally Ministry. There you will have a weekly teaching just for you. Are you in the Los Angeles area? Join us for our once a month meeting called Rally LA. There we gather once a month to encourage you in faith. For more information, visit rallymin.org. And now let's get back to the show. Okay, welcome back to Rally TV. So, I made a decision yeah. to be nice to that lady. <laughs> yes. uh, <sighs> oh, come on, Brother Rick. You could have gave her your piece of your mind. Mm. You had a right. <laughs> you know, she was in the wrong. Yeah, mm. I understand all that. Yes. But you know what? She asked me, what are you guys doing in this building? Yeah. We're having church, mm -hmm. and what? I, and I'm the preacher. Yeah. What if I was mean and ugly? I would have sowed mm -hmm. bad seed. Everything's a seed. My life is a seed. Mm -hmm. Think about it. Our lives are yes. seeds. Doesn't matter. Oh, I just heard something in the spirit. Mm -hmm. Women, your body's a seed. Mm -hmm. If you're showing yes. a lot of cleavage, you're wearing a very high skirt. And you're doing this on purpose to mm. grab attention, that's bad seed. Yes. Mm -hmm. If you're being uh, 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 sexy on purpose to draw <laughs> attention, making mm. men fail, that's a bad seed. Mm. And you're going to reap it. Yeah, not a good harvest. Not a good harvest. Mm. Everything you do in life is Everything. a seed. Everything. You cheat on your taxes, mm -hmm. uh, you steal a candy bar at the store. I mean, everything, everything. you do. And life's a seed. Yes. And you will reap. Listen, if I'm going to reap, I want to make sure I'm sowing good seed. Yes. All right, let me continue with my list here, Nitty. <laughs> Words of kindness. How about, okay, prayer is a seed. Mm. When you pray for a city, mm -hmm. pray for a nation, yes. pray for Israel. Mm -hmm. Yes. Pray for those who, you know, uh, the homeless people, mm -hmm. the gangs, yes. the drug lords. When we pray for people, it's a seed. It is. It We're is. sowing prayer mm -hmm. and people will pray for us. Yes. So if you spend 20 minutes in the morning, 30 minutes, an hour praying in the Holy Ghost, mm -hmm. and you begin to pray over a nation, that's mm -hmm. good seed. Yes, it is. Life is a seed. Mm -hmm. Let me keep going here. Uh, we talked about sowing the word already. Mm -hmm. You said words of kindness. Uh, words of kindness. How about love? Mm-hmm. Sowing love. Mm -hmm. What do you mean, Brother Rick? Mm. 
We can act like Jesus. For the Bible says, for God is love. And we know that Jesus is God. When you sow love into people, when you have compassion, you know, we just did a, mm -hmm. uh, we did eight TV shows mm -hmm. on compassion mm -hmm. about uh, we should have love for the lost. Mm -hmm. We should want to reach the lost. We shouldn't be so busy in life, Nettie, where we walk by people mm -hmm. and we don't have no compassion towards them. Mm -hmm. That's love. She, uh, uh, witnessing to people, mm -hmm. doing outreaches, going to churches, events, mm -hmm. sowing into ministry that's reaching the lost. Mm -hmm. That's love. Mm -hmm. When you sow Jesus into people, you're sowing love. Mm -hmm. Now, on another note, love, how about acts of Acts of love, mm -hmm. buying somebody something for Mother's Day mm -hmm. or Father's Day yeah. or uh, somebody's birthday party. Mm -hmm. You know, it's all an opportunity yeah. to show love. Showing the love of God. Showing it's the love seed. of God. It's a seed. Okay, Nettie, um, I, I really appreciate you. Um, we've been living in this house now. It's almost going on two years. I remember our first Christmas here, you baked cookies for all the neighbors. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do it again. That's love. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Every year I'll do it. That's love yeah. though. Mm -hmm. You wanted to make a statement. Mm -hmm. And this is our statement. Love lives in this home. Yes. And you know what? All of our neighbors know that. Oh yeah. And they're all kind to us. They watch our home when we're gone. We pray for them. Yeah. We pray for them all the time. We minister to yes. them. Yes. They give us things. Yes. We're sowing good seeds into That's our That's love. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like Tina Turner used to say, what does love have to do with it? Everything. Everything. Because love is a seed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, let me keep going here. <laughs> How about forgiveness? This is a tough one. Oh, wow. We were in a meeting the other night and I was sharing this message. <laughs> and I said, you need to sow forgiveness. <laughs> and there was a man on the front row. He's a pastor. <laughs> and he likes to joke. <laughs> and, and he said, oh, no, I'll just shoot the guy. You know, <laughs> he, he just... Yeah. But I'm just saying, yeah. instead of forgiving, just shoot the guy. Yeah. No, yeah. you don't want to shoot the guy. How about forgive? forgive? Listen, when you forgive somebody, you'll be forgiven. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. When somebody does you wrong, you forgive them. Mm -hmm. How about when somebody owes you money and they don't pay you back? Mm -hmm. Think mm -hmm. of that for a minute. Mm -hmm. It's an opportunity for you to sow seed. Mm -hmm. You know, um, years ago, we were selling a a camera, a movie camera. And I was out of town and our office met those people and they wanted to buy it. They bought it. Long story short, they gave us a, a false um, cashier's check. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And uh, the bank called and said, the cashier's check's not good. It's fraud. Mm -hmm. It's false. Mm -hmm. How would I say that? Yeah. Yeah. A counterfeit. Yeah. And immediately the office told me, hey, we know who these people are. Uh, we can get the cops. Let's call the mm -hmm. cops. And God said, no, sow it into them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What? He goes, if you sow it, you'll be able to reach them by love. You'll be able to reach them by prayer. And you know, that's what we did. Mm -hmm. About two weeks later, someone gave us $100,000 to buy a new camera. Mm -hmm. Listen, whenever you take time to sow, you'll always win. Mm -hmm. You'll always come up on top. Oh, yes. Forgiveness. You so good. You got to sow mm -hmm. good. Mm -hmm. Forgiveness is a big thing because mm -hmm. a lot of people don't want to forgive family members. Mm -hmm. What's wow. wrong with the mother-in-law? I have such a great... <laughs> why is everybody against their mother-in-law? I don't know. I have the world's greatest mother-in-law. Yes. I love my mother-in-law. Me too. Mercy Gazala. I know you have a good mother-in-law yes. too. We love our mother-in-laws. <laughs> forgive. Yes. Forgive your neighbor mm -hmm. and you'll be forgiven. Yes. So forgiveness. So good seeds. So good seeds. Mm. All right. Uh, we talked about a cup of coffee, Nettie. Mm. I'm always buying somebody a cup of coffee. That's why I always, my cup runneth over. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it does. I'm always blessed. Mm -hmm. I never lack you no never good lack thing. You never lack coffee. Never. All right. How about <laughs> shoes? Oh, shoes, shoes, mm. shoes. Now, um, I remember one time I was at a, a meeting with Kenneth Copeland in Peru. Mm-hmm. And we were sitting in the speaker's room, uh, me and him, and the room was quiet. And I was sitting next to him, just like we are here. Mm -hmm. And I had a pair of black Clark boots on, mm -hmm. brand new, super nice boots. I still have them. Mm -hmm. And Brother Copeland whispered to me, he goes, I like your boots. Mm -hmm. I said, oh, Brother Copeland, you like my boots? Would you like to have a pair? Mm -hmm. He goes, yes. 
Mm-hmm. So long story sh- sh- long story short, mm-hmm. about a month later, mm-hmm. we were in another meeting with him. Yes. In Sacramento. And we took him those boots. Mm-hmm. We bought him a pair of boots. He put them <laughs> on. And this is what he said to me. He goes, Rick, now what are you, what are you going to do mm-hmm. with a hundred pair of boots? Yes. Because I sold mm-hmm. a pair of boots into him. And you've been getting boots. I've been getting a lot mm-hmm. of boots. Somebody just bought me a nice pair of Harley Davidson boots. Mm-hmm. Yes. Then another pastor yes. a couple of weeks ago bought me a pair of mm-hmm. boots. I'm just saying, yes. you're going to reap. You're going to reap. <laughs> now, 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 think about we've been getting sprinkles uh, a little bit here and there. Uh-huh. What do you think this year is going to be oh. like? We're going to need more room. Grand. Grand. Mm -hmm. We're going to need to build bigger barns. Mm -hmm. Because God's saying it's It's due season. Due season. That's good. All right, let me finish this last Mm -hmm. one. How about clothing? Mm -hmm. You know, we're always sewing clothing. Mm -hmm. We're always blessing people. Yes. You know, we're always, you know, there's times I've been in a church service and I had a jacket on while Mm -hmm. I was preaching and God said, take it off and give it to somebody. Yes. Uh-huh. Actually, what you're doing, you're transferring the mm-hmm. anointing mm-hmm. while I was preaching. Mm-hmm. We've done that many times. And you know what? People give me things all the time. Yes, exactly. I'm just saying, life is a seed. Yes. Nettie, read that scripture one more time. Galatians please. 6, 7. Be not deceived. God is not mocked. For whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. Whatsoever. So this list that I read, it's just a few things. Mm-hmm. Whatsoever Rick soweth mm-hmm. or Nettie mm-hmm. or our viewers, yes. we're going to reap. Yes, we are. Now, this is why it's so important to make your list. Mm-hmm. You might say, Brother Rick, I, I don't have no list. You know, I don't know where to start. Just prayer. Mm-hmm. Get into prayer mm-hmm. and say, Lord, you know all the good seeds that I have sown. Yes. I'm asking you, God. Mm-hmm. I'm asking you for harvest. I'm asking you that it will be due season for Mm -hmm. us. Yes. And from this day forward, Mm -hmm. make it a point to only sow good seeds. Be watchful before you open your mouth, before you make a decision, before you answer. Always think, okay, what kind of seed is is this? So that's something that you could be aware of more because you will reap whatever seed you sow. It's so so important. It's Mm -hmm. so important to be sowing good seed. Mm -hmm. Because whatsoever a man soweth, yes. that shall he reap. So be watchful. What did you want us to say every every day we wake I up? I want you to wake up every morning when you open your eyes, mm-hmm. when your feet hit the ground. I yes. want you to say today, yes. today is due season. Is due season. Today is due season. Mm-hmm. Say it throughout the day. Right. Mm-hmm. Every time you sow a seed, say it's due season. Yes. You need to expect. Uh-huh. Because this is a word from and God. And we will, we will be giving you testimonies. Yes. And then you can be emailing us testimonies. Yeah. Email us your testimonies mm-hmm. of your due season harvest breakthrough. Yes. Manifestation. Uh-huh. And we'll be testified. Yes. Amen. Amen. Because this is a word from God. Yes, Father, I pray for all those that are watching. Mm-hmm. I pray encouragement. Yes. I come against discouragement. I pray encouragement yes. for Lord today is due season. Yes. And we take it now in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. You know, amazing. That's the word that I'm hearing right now, Nettie. Mm-hmm. Amazing, amazing, amazing. God is amazing. Yes. He's above everybody in every situation. You know, here at Rally Ministry, There's so much that we want to say. Mm -hmm. I just wrote our monthly newsletter. And uh, and in my newsletter, I was saying, Eddie, I just want to thank the people. Mm -hmm. I want to, that's my heart right now. I'm overflowing with joy and gratitude for you. Uh Listen, God has been doing so many amazing things here. We have seen so many lives touch. Yes, we have. You know, if Jesus would come back today, uh, I know there's a lot of work left to do, <laughs> but we have touched some people. Mm-hmm. I mean, we God has opened a lot of doors for us through our movies, mm-hmm. our books, here Rally TV, yes. rallies, crusades, uh-huh. traveling, so many different avenues, mm-hmm. Nettie. Tools, can I use that word, tools? Yes. Tools that God has given us to reach people. 
We just want to say thank you yes. for partnering with Rally Ministry. Mm -hmm. We thank you, we thank you, yes. we thank you. Yes, and you know, it's a new year and a lot of great things are going to be taking place. And we encourage you to stay connected with us, continue to stay connected with us uh, through our social sites, through our, your, our um, website, rallymen.org. Let us know what God is doing for you. Continue to send your prayer request. We pray for you daily. We're in agreement with you. Yeah. As you partner with us, we partner with you. And we pray for you daily. And we expect God to do great things for you. You know, you just said something. We had an employee that worked for us for nine years. And, and God blessed him. God raised him up. Now he's in ministry mm -hmm. on his own. He was a blessing to us. But this is what he said for nine years. You ready? Yes. He says, Rick, I'm committed to you guys, Rally Ministry, mm -hmm. because as you prosper, I prosper. Yes. I never forget him saying yes. that. And you know what? We say mm -hmm. that to you right now. As we prosper, you yes. prosper. We declare you're prospering spiritually, physically, mentally, socially, financially, family, ministry, yes. business, wants, needs, mm -hmm. goals, desires, and dreams. Yes, every area. That's my prayer for you right there all <laughs> the time. Okay, listen, what's going on? Well, Ned, I want to say this really quick. Now that we're in the new year, 2024, mm -hmm. we are focusing in only on what God's telling us to do. Yes. For instance, Rally Studios. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you, I can taste it. <laughs> yes, sir. I can taste yes, it. Yes, sir. I can taste Rally mm -hmm. Studio because we've been teaching about yeah. it's due, due season. season. So we want to thank you for your partnership in mm -hmm. praying and also declaring words of faith concerning Rally Studios. Yes. Soon. That's right. Soon. Yes. We'll I'm be in Rally Studios that. filming. Uh -huh. Now, we talked about the Rally California outreaches. Mm -hmm. Six of them <laughs> in California. And I was talking to God about that. It's his will to touch people in yes. California. Somebody yes. got to pack up and go. Mm -hmm. You know what? Here we go. Lord. Yes, we'll pack amen. up and go. And literally yes, pack up. There's a lot of stuff to we pack We have to up. all do our part. Exactly. Amen. So Rally California is taking place here mm -hmm. in the new year. Rally TV, our monthly meeting yes. once a month in Hollywood, Rally LA. Amen. Uh, our meetings that we're having, uh -huh. traveling. So many good yes. things are happening. Well, let me just say this. So many great things has happened. Mm -hmm. But because it's due season, yes. greater things are yes, happening. That's right. Why? Because Jesus is coming uh -huh. back. Sign me up, Jesus. <laughs> we love you guys. Yes. Go to rallymen.org for all the information. You can partner with us. If you want a monthly newsletter, just everything's right there yes. at rallymen.org. We love you guys. We call you blessed in Jesus' name.